We're here at Acupuncture Zen. Hey, what up? Uh, <laughs> Erwin Rivera. My guy. Going to be bare knuckle champion. Very soon. Very soon. This year, actually. This year, I predict. When's yes. your fight coming up? We have the next fight coming up on this Friday. This coming Friday. So, what is it like? Seven days, eight days? Yeah. Yeah, seven days. No, okay. seven days exactly. So, yeah. this, uh, this Friday coming up. And um, yeah, man, I'm excited. I'm excited to put in work. This is uh, this is a long time coming. You know, after my last uh, performance, I did great and everything. And then the guy told me, "Listen, we got we got to get you back on the show, 100%. We're gonna put you on the show." And then, like about two weeks went by, and then he told me it was gonna be September 8th. So there was a lot That's of nice. a lot of time, you know, to, uh, for me to to just have everything organized exactly as I like, you know to organize the proper training camp to to do it perfectly you know to not peak at the wrong time but peak at the right time and make sure that everything goes according to plan and everything is in perfect harmony oh, that's you know excellent. what i mean so now we're here man we're yeah. one week out um cutting weight that's why i'm a little more flaquito than yeah. normal <laughs> you know i'm yeah. cutting weight and uh i'm feeling good man i'm feeling mm. good i'm very excited and uh it's like I said, I just got done with some acupuncture and I had a nice little meditation. I was just visualizing everything, seeing everything, seeing potentialities and probabilities. And, you know, um, I saw the the outcomes as well. You know what I mean? And I chose, I highlighted in my mind which outcomes I wanted to be 100%, you know? Yeah, so sure. That's excellent. It, it's, 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 it's interesting stuff. It's actually called NLP, Neuro Linguistic Programming. Sure. You know, um, but I'm doing it instead of eliminating memories. I'm doing it to create memories and to manifest them into 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 reality. Yeah, beautiful. You know, so yeah, it was it was nice, man. You know, the points are fire. The, <laughs> points, the, the points are fire, and it I really got a nice little meditation. So, what would you say to people who, uh, let's say, in your fight field, right, mm -hmm. that haven't experienced acupuncture? Because when we were back with the Black Zillions mm -hmm. eight years, nine years ago, yeah there wasn't anybody who had acupuncture so much at that time and then we came on board and pretty well nearly yeah. everybody got acupuncture. Yeah, yeah, pretty much everybody. But what about, how has the acupuncture been helping you with your fighting career, recovery, things like that? Like what's the, what's I mean, the deal? I mean, it's definitely the healing, the healing properties for the body. You know, the healing properties for the body is 100%. Like, you know, it, it allows the blood to flow freely and no blockages, you know, and, um, when you learn about the mind and the spirit, you know, if you if you care to learn, you know, and you go and you do your research and you try to understand, you know, you can, uh, you find, you begin to finding like the benefits that it does for the, the spirit as well and the sure. mind as well, yeah. Yeah, you know, so good. because uh, there's no blockages in the chakras, in the chakras, you know, there's no yeah. blockages and because there's no blockages, you're able to think clearer, you're able to perform better, you know, have better focus. You know what I mean? So yeah. it, it's very beneficial, man. This shit's been around forever, and you know more than I do. Obviously, you're the professional, <laughs> you know, but from experience, I've been here for at least more than 10 years now, yeah. you know, doing this shit. And I see phenomenal benefits, man. You know what I mean? I mean, granted, I was always like the type that pe to, to want to learn about the mind, the body, the soul, but being able to kind of just let everything out in here when I'm in here is it's been beneficial you know and I'm seeing it all kind of come into perfect harmony yeah, as, that's we, as we discussed uh -huh. you know yeah, yeah yeah I'm a big fan of the acupuncture as well yeah. <laughs> I give it to myself at night time yeah. sometimes when I need <laughs> nice, it you know nice, nice. put the points on top of my head or nice, this point nice. here yeah. and then I realize sometimes oh that hurts a little bit <laughs> yeah it sure hurts it sometimes. doesn't hurt that bad though yeah you know it's just like the deeper you go in with the needle <laughs> right yeah but sometimes it's necessary because if yeah. You know, when you do, somebody has a problem and you yeah. do just some light needles, yeah. it might help a little bit. Yeah. But sometimes you got to get in to re release the trigger point, do some of this yeah. dry needling stuff that's on the wall. A hundred percent, man. You have to, you have to understand, like, we're so embedded as human beings to think that, like, to avert pain, avert yeah, yeah, danger, true, huh? avert pain and avert danger and, and yeah. anything that, like, um, anything that's, like, going to, causes any type of pain you know or discomfort sure. more of like yeah. that's a better word discomfort mm -hmm. so you have to understand man like you you have to put yourself out there don't put yourself in danger because there's a difference between danger and discomfort 
don't put yourself in danger, but put yourself in those uncomfortable positions, those uncomfortable places, because you never know what can come from them. And That's it's like true. we talk about, like with the needles, like I did dry, dry, dry needling the first time, what was it, two weeks ago, three yeah. weeks ago? I, I never did those. And it hurt, man. That shit hurt, bro. But <laughs> it was worth it, man. Yeah, it was necessary. Instant, man. instantly, my my yeah. hip was because my hip was hurting from kicking so much, and immediately, like the hip just relaxed. Yeah. It loosened up very quick. It was a little sore, but you know you gotta trust the yeah. process. And after the next one or two days, it, I'm good. Sure. You know what I mean? To put it on a parallel with like massage, for instance, if you've got tight muscles and you go and get a Swedish massage. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a little bit helpful, but exactly. you got to you do know? sometimes yeah. do some deep therapy, and that's along with the acupuncture. Yeah, you got to be. Sometimes you got to do some. You got to do points. uncomfortable things yeah. sometimes. Put yourself out there, you know. Take those risks because the benefit in return sure. is going to be so much higher. You know, you know I mean? there's a lot of acupuncturists that like are anti dry needling, which is basically the needling term that was coined by the physical therapist mm -hmm. for the most part, and they do a two weekend course to get certified in dry needling. Mm -hmm. And an acupuncturist, the basic one, goes to school for four years. But the long story short, I wasn't anti-dry needling. I wanted to learn that modality. So I got certified in yeah. upper and lower extremity with yeah. that because I wanted to be in line with the physical therapist and I wanted to find other people that I needed to refer to with this type yeah, of therapy yeah. as nice. well. Yeah. So, <clears throat> so we need to use these like, we're like one community and it's not mm -hmm. like we're only doing this thing. You know, yeah, we got to yeah. find the right path for different hey, people. Hey man, right? you're, you're a master of your craft, bro. You oh, know? Thank you. Yeah, you're a master of your craft. It. You you want to perfect your craft and make sure that you can do it to the best of your ability. Sure, yeah. That's why, I, I, you know, I, I yeah, respect the you. shit out of you, Doc. You know, because I see myself as being a master in yeah, my craft as well, sure. you know, and Big wanting time. just to be the best that I can be yeah. doing what I'm doing, you know. Yeah. So anybody that you see that is a master in, in their own individual field, whatever their yeah. endeavor may be, you know, you have so much respect for him. Because yeah, that's it's like, true. bro, you're, you're a G man. You know yeah, what I mean? Thank like, you. <laughs> yeah, you know, I respect yeah. the fuck out of you, Doc. <laughs> like that, man. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, and yeah. I appreciate you. Yeah, man. So, Erwin, when are you fighting next? Um, fighting September 8th, next week. Uh, it's going to be next week, September 8th, in Jacksonville, Florida. Okay. Yeah. What's the fight company? It's uh, the same one as before, uh, Game Bread FC. And, um,. For those that want to know how to watch the fights, you know, it's very simple. You just go on Jorge Masvidal's Game Bread page and on YouTube and it'll stream live. It'll be live oh, on perfect. YouTube. Oh, so you can excellent. all watch it, yep. That's excellent. Let's turn that timer <laughs> off. <laughs> Which room's that? Oh yeah, so we're gonna flip her. Yeah, yeah, you can go through, don't worry. This will be part of the video. <laughs> <laughs> Got with the bloopers. Yeah, we're real here. Got this is live, baby. Got with the live. <laughs> so what's next for you after this next fight then? Yes, so next, well, after I whooped this guy. <laughs> yeah. After I put a whooping on him, um, you know, I, I'm i just in there to do my job, man. I'm going to make sure that I, I take him out by any means necessary after I win more than anything. Um, you know, I'm gonna pay my respects to him. And then I'm gonna call out my shot, bro. I'm gonna yeah. call out my title shot, man. I want the title shot, that's what's yeah, that's on excellent. my mind, yeah. you know, uh, in this fight. I know that following this fight, that's two great fights back to back, and I predict that this fight will be amazing, and I'm gonna finish this guy. And it's gonna be a great fight. It's gonna be a phenomenal finish. Like, Another fight of you the know, night. Better than that, yeah, you know sure. what I mean. This is gonna be a performance of the night because I'm yeah. gonna finish this guy. Mm. That's what's on my mind, mm. you know. And um, after I do, like I said, I wanna call out my shot, man. I want, I want Mass Vidal and uh, I want uh, Dean to take me seriously. I'm gonna show him that, hey, bro, I want the title shot. You know, I want yeah. the title shot. This is, this is my home. I'm gonna make this my home. You know what I mean? So, this, that's, that's where my mind is at. You know, I wanna get the title, I want to defend it several times, and then move on to what's next, you yeah, know what I mean? Sure. But this is what I truly desire right now for the moment, because the company is working great with me right now, but they're only going to work better with me, you know? So yeah, long as I sure. show them, as I show them that I can do this, like this is like I'm legit and I'm with you, I'm, I'm riding with you, let's win together, sure, you yeah. know what I mean? Like as long as I show them that and I know that I will, they're gonna work with me and then yeah. I'll be able to 
financially be in a good place, do what I love to do on a daily basis. I can start working for things outside of fighting, start setting up my career nicely, start yeah, setting up my daughter you. good, my family good. You know what I mean? So it's more than just fighting, man. Yeah, you know, people sure. just see it as just barbaric and the fighting thing, but there's more to it, man. We all have stories, bro. Yeah. And I'm just trying to live my best life, Good man. For you. Congratulations. You know? And I came a long way, man. Yeah. Just coming, coming from oh, where I yeah. came, bro. I came a long way, man. And I'm still pushing, I'm still going. You know what I mean? And I'm gonna get what I know that I can get. Yeah. You know, because it's in my mind. It's already, it's yeah. already like I said, it's a probability that it already exists. Yeah. You know, it's just For a matter sure. of stepping into that reality. <laughs> That's true, right? Huh? You know, yeah. Yeah, into that energetic body. Yeah, man. Doing your yeah. thing. Well, God bless you. Yeah. And congratulations yeah. on all your efforts. Thank That's you, right. You know? It's huge for you. you know? Yeah. Amazing. Yeah, and it's nice to like. That's why I love like about this because like you've seen everything, Doc. You've seen everything, man. Yeah, the ups, sure. the downs, and the ups again. You know? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so it's like it's nice, man. Yeah. You know, because you can share it with people that you sure. you admire, you know, and you and you trust. Well, you, you know what I mean? So I'm happy, man, and I'm grateful more than anything always yeah. for everything that you do for me. Thank you. You yeah. know what I mean? Uh, because it's like I said, it's a team effort, bro. Yeah. You know, I consider you a part of my team, big time. Like you know, yeah. you help me a lot substantially, and it's just like. I'm grateful, man. You know right. what I mean? God you have to always you. be grateful for the people that help you. And That's true. You help me a lot, bro. Yeah. I'm grateful, bro. All this shit, man, this shit all works, bro. Yeah. And as long as I'm good in here, that's all that matters. You know that's what I mean? Right, yeah. But physically, <laughs> I'll be 100% <laughs> yeah, ready to do true. what I got to do. So it's nice, man. You okay. know? Yeah. Many blessings. Thank you, brother. Let's okay. go. Let's get this. Yes. <laughs>